since Letty does Marvel's Iron Fist. So in the last episode, Danny gets his first day at just, you know, being the co-owner of a company. And he manages to get essentially everyone else pissed off at him because the new drug they were developing to mass produce and sell at a profit. Yeah, Danny wants to essentially give it out for free. In fact, he wants to sell it at a loss to pay for distribution as well. So, you know, good guy Danny. Yeah, probably bad company owner. But the media seems to like it because... Ward was so pissed off at this, he told a reporter what Danny had done, and she essentially made him a hero. So, it's gonna be interesting to see Ward get more and more pissed off as people, you know, just begin to really like how real he is, and how honorable, and, you know, the fact that he's given out a cure to a disease. So, that's gonna be really cool, until, you know, Ward gets so pissed off he fucks everything up and tries to kill Danny. This season's probably going to end with Danny either killing Ward or Ward's gonna end up in jail or something. But yeah. Anyway, so Colleen is still doing the cage fighting and she's getting pretty good at it. I'm kind of worried she gets carried away and gets her ass like totally kicked. And that's how we meet Claire, who just happens to be in the area and be like, hmm, that person is, it appears they're dying. They are dying. So, <laughs> that's going to be kind of interesting. And Joy uh, actually was targeted by a triad. They were going to kidnap her because, you know, Rand didn't buy the pier for them and bought it for the hand instead. So... The triad decided to tr attempt to kidnap Joy, and yeah, pretty much the Hand found out that Joy had been uh, targeted and attempted to be kidnapped. In turn, her father found out, who is a part of the Hand. You know, it's not just he was resurrected and he has to do stuff for them, he's a ninja too. So he goes and he extracts his revenge, and we get our first look at the hand as an organization or just that portion which apparently is being led by madame gao so but yeah that's gonna be interesting to see we already got hogarth wonder if she's gonna come back because legal shit's gonna get fucked up and stuff is gonna happen and yeah still no misty knight waiting for misty knight and i think that's it marvel's iron fist season one episode five under leaf Pluck Lotus. Let's get started. Oh yes, the working women. Here to kick some ass. I'm guessing these are all the secretaries? Oh, she cut her hair, I think. Ooh, stilettos. Okay! Okay, okay! Uh... Did they just get some random druggie? What the hell is this? What just happened? You broke in. My mom always told me patience is a virtue. What the fuck just happened? <laughs> How much can I order? Who are these women? These scary, scary women. I'm guessing this episode is going to be Daddy trying to get those off the street because they're, I don't know, affecting people. It's probably going to affect Colleen with at least some of her dojo students. Well, whoever the Einstein is behind this made sure there'd be no limit to how much one can make. Yeah. Oh, are they trying to sell it to I him too? Like Thank you so much for your help, Sam. <laughs> to her, 
he will be ever he will be forever known as the weird guy that bows <laughs> that his thanks. She's starting to crack. She looks like she wants to apologize now. Okay, why is he looking at him like he's crazy? The Undying. From Kunlun. Shao Lao made me a living weapon. Okay. Oh, they do reference a dragon! Uh, we don't get to see him, but... But Harold... It's between the two of you. I have real business in the real world to deal with. And you're a real dickhead, you know that? Hey. Ooh, fired. <laughs> he did that so quickly and without looking. Oh, she's falling for the boss. He's just like, oh, asking in questions again. She has really good makeup, by the way. I just remember she's supposed to have a bruise across her face. You're also a good businesswoman. That means you have to make hard decisions. You can't be both. And you do that. Better than most of us. If it was up to me, I'd just be like, fuck those guys. It's the last thing a control freak wants to hear. No! Daddy, stay! The ladies! The ladies are here! Oh, he didn't know about the meeting. I didn't know. I... You're different than the others. Compassionate. Please, will you help us? Oh my gosh! I am... Is that Claire? Is that Claire? Oh my gosh! Come on, hit me. Or just another one of his students. People doing things for me all the time. She's so cool. Oh, I've been waiting for Claire. She's so amazing. And the two of them already know each other. I'm in the middle of a lesson. Her temple. Hey. Oh, this is so awkward! Expecting some... Is this a date? What? No, of course not. I don't even know what a date is! I mean... Oh, actually, I don't think he would have ever been on a date in his life! Good. It's definitely not that. Yeah. Claire's just like, I'm packing up my shit to go. Enterprises and any of the affected... Individuals will win this in court. Drinking on the job, really, dude? I just want to make sure your emotions aren't clouding the fact that this okay. was clearly a setup. Who cares what Ward should not be telling anyone, giving any preach about how emotions okay. affect the job. Because twice now, his father has I said to protect know. Danny, sure and he's tried to have him killed. So, you know, and he completely ignored Danny about the heroin thing just because he was pissy with Danny. What a hypocrite. He is not about to snort heroin. Or is he just looking at the symbol? No, he looks like he's debating it.
this dude has, like, really bad stress issues. He's like, I don't know where you're looking from! <laughs> so I'm just gonna make sure you see this somehow. It didn't even occur to him that it might be, um, what's it called? Just a microphone or something. And now they're just like, uh, putting that back down and waiting for Danny to finish. To you three rare and supreme sources of refuge, I offer. He's like, aw, I know you guys didn't do it the whole way through, but thanks for pretending. You get a burger, or was it all just vegetarian crap? Wow, Claire. Only ate vegetables we grew in the monastery. Asking the correct the questions. My friend have handled. Yeah. Danny's just like, I just wanted to have a nice dinner and not think about shit like that. Of course. She's like, never mind. See ya, Danny. <laughs> oh, take whatever you want. She's just like, I'm taking it all. She's so cute. Cool. Namaste. See ya. <laughs> He's like, wrong religion. <laughs> What's going on. So what are you gonna do? I'm gonna go kick ass. Ward doesn't believe me. There's a shipment tonight at eight. Oh. Uh, he is asking her on a date. You're joking. You want me to come with you? <laughs> He's so cute! <laughs> It'll be on their streets, and everything you've done for them will have been for nothing. I need your help. He's making it personal. I'm your landlord. He's like... <laughs> she's like fucking rich Was boys. I want the league under my sink fixed. <laughs> is is that a no? As the memo is that a yes? Indicated, let us do what we do best and save the day. I've carefully weighed our options. I like how they look around like, is that what we do best? I've years this company has ever had. The bad publicity could cost us even more in the long run. Can we honestly take that kind of risk? We See? Here. There he goes again. Everyone is not His father to told him to do something. This looks bad. And they'll boycott our products. Yeah. This is a risk worth taking. Stroke his ego. Stroke his ego. Shall we have a vote? It seems like he's more reasonable when he gets his ego stroked, so... Is she going to have an outfit too? That'd be the coolest thing. Show me your style. Double hand, boy. He's like, whoa, calm down, girl. You're getting really excited there. Yeah, this is their idea of a date. You're amazing. Them doing this is going on a date. That a chemical plant may have been responsible for 15 cases of cancer in a Staten Island neighborhood, endangering the lives of innocent children. Why is this guy still... Like, why does he still have his position? He's just a big, emotional baby. And he's getting worse and worse. His bourbon is almost empty. Not to mention, I haven't seen him drink anything but bourbon for a while. Is that Colleen's car? No, it's probably Danny's car. Wait, didn't Danny say he didn't know how to drive? Not really? 
lose a kid. Well, just watch yourself. So also, why was Tanny driving? I mean, I don't know. Does he even have a driver's license? Makes it feels good winning. Felt good. I was hurting those guys. Really good. Scared me. That's because you're a little cray cray, Colleen. The world. Oh yes, very romance anime way of hiding, guys. It's just nice having someone to count on. You have the Meachums. <laughs> yeah, right. Do you have someone? Oh, I can be that this someone. This is so weird. They're flirting when they're about to. Kick ass. I'm not good at this stuff. What stuff? Talking. <laughs> She's so cute! <gasps> oh my gosh. I don't even know what I'm doing or something. <sighs> She's just like, man, I am falling for you, little geeky boy. Oh my gosh, this is totally the tag team action that I wanted. They are so cool. Oh my gosh. Does Danny have his flash on? His flash is off. Danny. We're on the right track, okay? Trust me. Well, they could be inside the equipment. Why would they need this is the one. It's gotta be. Or it could be behind the rest of the stuff. I mean, it looks like that one has a fake back. He should have left the phone with her if she's just going to be up there. Oh, Danny. You're too fucking close, man. Just open a box up, man. Let's lock this one up. Oh, shit. Danny! Well, what's behind that curtain thing, Danny? Colleen's just like, fuck, I'm gonna have to follow that, aren't I? The fuck is that? Come on, Danny, focus. You can't open it. Open a box while you're at it. How does she know the keys are inside? Okay. That works too. I mean, I guess I know why she didn't want to take her car in case she gets caught, but all she has to do is follow the truck, really. There we go. Go in. Quickly now, Danny. Dude, is Madame Gao in the back or something? And I'm bodyguard to make sure the chemist doesn't get out. Colleen's just like, shit. Danny! Use the iron fist! Ooh, that looked gross! God damn it! Of course he does! He's not gonna make it, Danny. You don't understand. No way, does he have like healing powers or something? I'm not sure, I don't remember. Or is he, or, oh, he's probably planning on punching through the doors, huh? 
Ha ha ha! I thought he was gonna use his iron fist to heal the guy. Colleen's just like, best date ever! He's gonna die. Oh. Colleen's just like, never mind, change that. Worst date ever. Ward. Did Ward hey. just OD? To help me figure out how to correct it. <laughs> okay, like, the only thing you should be listening to Ward about is ask him a question and then do the exact opposite of what he tells you to do. Mm. He's the one that ruined it! You, me, and Danny. <laughs> Give me your credit card. Yeah. Hey. Oh yeah, I forgot Claire. Claire's always like fucking oh, shit. We <laughs> expand. Claire is so amazing. I was hoping you could stay here. I have lessons here. I... We can move into your bedroom. Uh, we'll, we'll figure something out. I can move him to your bedroom <laughs> if you want this guy in your bedroom. Shit. You gotta be kidding me. What? Claire's just like, fuck! The hand. Wait a minute. Okay, this is not something a rich kid from the Upper West Side can just handle, okay? This is. Okay, Claire should know by now that if she's helping anyone. With any remote injuries like this, with any weird circumstances, they have powers. Limitations, you have to accept yours. This is like the third time. Let's see, Luke Cage. Uh, the third time, fourth time if you count Jessica Jones, that she's had to deal with people with powers. I've been training my whole life for this. This is the one. Claire's just like, the fuck are you talking about? I am the only one. She's like, I've heard that before. My mother says I can. Then I have to believe too. Claire is so cool. Going against them on your own—that's some foolish bullshit. No matter who you are. I'm not alone. I got Colleen. This is my choice. Plus, I really like the thrill today. Neil. Kneel so I can whack you in the head with this stick. Oh, is that stick a knife? She about to cut his head off? Yes, it is. Oh my god, I knew it. Oh. Oh. Uh, that's nasty. Oh, this is the first time we've seen her face in the show. This show. Ah, that's so cool. Ah, it's over. Okay, it just ended. Oh my gosh, shit is getting so real. Oh, like, okay. No. First, the more toned down shit. What the fuck? I don't even know what is going on with Ward anymore. I mean, first he was an asshole, and then, yeah, everyone was mean to him. So he decided to become, like, really sad and depressing and suicidal, so. Not what I thought was gonna happen. I thought he was gonna get angry and like try to fight people. It looks like he's just giving up. So that might change later, but for right now, I don't even understand why he's a character other than to fuck up like corporate shit and disobey his father, which seems very, I don't know. That's just stupid. So, you know, Joy isn't even in charge anymore. She's just kind of like, yeah, okay, do what Danny says. And then Danny isn't around because he's fighting the hand. It's his destiny. But 
I don't even know what's going on with Ran Ran Corporation or how they're going to handle that or if it's even going to exist anymore by the end of this season. But yeah, maybe it's setting up that he just loses the company and that's why he starts Heroes for Hire with Luke Cage or like, I don't know, man. I don't know. But it's great to see Claire. She is amazing. Oh my gosh. I love the actress. I love the character. It's amazing to see her again. Oh, I was waiting for this. She's so cool. And then Colleen. You go, Colleen. Colleen's so badass. She just wants to help Danny, you know? He, she, he has his destiny to defeat the hand and she's just like, okay, cool. Can I fight people? <laughs> but yeah, the hand is going to be pissed. And whoa. Like, we're going to get some ninja action the next episode. That's going to be awesome. And we haven't seen Danny's costume. I don't even know if we're going to see it, but that'd be cool to see it, right? And maybe Colleen will get an outfit, too. I don't know. But, yeah, at least I am so glad I got to see Claire. But, hey, maybe they might do some weird tie-in from the other show. I know that... Jessica Jones was mentioned before in other um, shows, and I think Daredevil's been mentioned in pretty much every show so far. So, you know, that'd be cool to see, but I guess I'm just gonna have to wait until the next episode! These are getting really good, guys. Once you get past the first few, they rev up, they get really good, so... That's all I got for you for now, so thank you so much for liking and subscribing, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye! Hey everyone, you're freaking watching Letty Does Stuff. If you like what you saw, you can subscribe to her channel by clicking that circle button up there. Or, you can check out some more of her videos along here. She also has some Patreon things set up that you can find by clicking that square button down there. See you later, suckers! Pew, 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 pew!